Yeah. Okay, here I am in the golf studio. Behind me, Chris is doing some testing on what ball he's going to play through 2020. He's trying the Pro V1, the TaylorMade, and also the differences between things like the Pro V1 and the Pro V1 X. But I just interrupted things because I want him to test. This is a Pro V1, albeit yellow. It's the same ball as an old Pro V1, despite the colour, but also one of these, the Dunlop 65. This ball would be out in around 1980, so it's a good probably 40 years old now. So we're going to just give it a go and see what different numbers we get from the modern Pro V1 to a Dunlop 65. I see you can, you can stop that now. Okay, so here we have the Pro V1. Chris is using the new SIM driver for this test. Let's see what happens. Pretty good carry. Just shot a 300 carry, running up to 321. Are you going to hit another? that good looks really good look at the carry on this one oh it's huge wow 312 carry 340 total great hit and now on the tee peg is the dunlop 65 the 1980 golf ball what is the difference gonna be Tea. Look at that, so far down distance wise. Let's have another go. Two shots with each ball, and then we'll go and compare the numbers. Great straight shot. Certainly a better one than the other one. It's a decent carry, but way down again. I've ripped that one. You've ripped that one. <laughs> 281 carry for 305. Let's go take a more detailed look at the numbers. Okay, so we can see, looking at the numbers, the Pro V1 at the top with the yellow, the Dunlop at the bottom in the orange. The swing speed on average, both, well, 114 mile now, the Dunlop average in 114.5. That was the club speed, remember, but look at the ball speed, 169 on the Pro V1, 157, nearly 12 mile an hour less ball speed from the Dunlop. The spin, significantly more. We did get one, the second one with the Pro V1 that you can see there, quite a low um, backspin reading, but that was down to strike. It was a bit high toe. But then the important numbers we were looking at today, the total distances, and you can see the average with the Pro V1, 305 carry for an average of 330. The Dunlop 266 carry for 289 average. So that's some 40 something yards less distance with the Dunlop. So an average of one yard per year since that Dunlop came out has been gained. 